Hey guys, Emma Hammond Willis, wife of Bruce Willis, slams stupid headlines and basically seeing not everything is so bad between her and her husband Bruce, uh, even though he has dementia, but sometimes they still feel a lot of joy uh, being together and it's not always dark days for them. Uh, and actually, Emma said that a lot of stupid headlines click bait you, uh, saying some awful stuff about them, but it's not true. Let's see what Emma said. It's Sunday morning and I'm triggered. I just got clickbaited. <laughs> I'm just scrolling, minding my own business, and just saw a headline and got clickbaited that had to do with my own family. The headline basically says, there is no more joy in my husband. Now, I can just tell you that is far from the truth. I think uh, she's in a very bad situation right now. That's why she's reacting like that. Because uh, around celebrities, it's a lot of hype. It's been since day one, probably. And uh, as long as I remember myself, like it was magazines, uh, websites, uh, now YouTube videos, where people like talking weird stuff about celebrities. Uh, I just got clickbaited on a video where it says like, oh, P. Diddy killed Tupac. And you kind of like, oh, is it really happened? Or why people are actually thinking that? Mm, so it's a lot of stuff going on. So the way that she's so shocked about it, it seems like she's nervous and uh, not in a good place in her life, obviously. Um, but she needs to understand it's going to happen again and again and again, unfortunately. And um, I like that she speaks her truth. She should do this more often. Uh, and I only can wish her strength, uh, mental and physical. I'm not saying that dementia is rainbows and unicorns. It is not. But there is also another side of it that is so beautiful. And I just think that when people are writing about dementia, I think they really need to show all sides of it, not just focus on this. Um, the dark cloud of it because dementia is so much more than that hopefully what she describes is true and she definitely feel like some days uh, that it's not always dark and some days it's rainbows uh, in their relationship because i understand it's tough for everyone tough for their kids tough for her uh being in a situation like that when a when a person i don't i don't know like uh, thank god i didn't speak to anyone have this uh, terrible disease i don't have anyone in my close circle um but um what i read about it it's like basically a person is getting worse and worse maybe not with every day but with every month for sure so uh it's it's tough it's incredibly tough and a terrible disease it's even hard to explain how terrible it, it is 100 percent, there is grief and sadness it, there's all of that but you start a new chapter and that chapter is filled let me just tell you what it is it's filled with love it's filled with connection it's filled with joy it's filled with happiness that's where we are i mean again it's great if she says something like that and she feels is genuine and uh she knows what she says and, it, and, and it's actual truth so uh hopefully i mean hopefully everything will be all right with bruce and her i don't uh I've never heard that you can actually recover from dementia, uh, but you know, if they feel some happy days, but they still there's still some happy days for them, like she claims to be. It's awesome. I'm only happy for them. So stop with these stupid headlines, these stupid clickbaity things that freak people out. Stop doing that. There's nothing to see here. Okay. Mm, I see what she says. I understand what she says. Like yeah nothing to see here it's a tragedy in their family and of course when people talking in spreading stupid rumors about them it's makes people mad and uh but you know like she should give people more updates so uh if she's giving uh bruce's fans more updates then people not gonna speculate about this stuff and then all this click clickbait things that uh, some users post they're not gonna get so many views um, the simple as that. I understand it's hard for her especially probably because she's in a terrible situation right now and uh, 
she's really really nervous about everything that was going on in her life but uh, she doesn't want people speculate on that unfortunately there will be a lot of people who wants to make money on that who wants to uh, speculate on that um, that's why she needs to update fans herself that's how i see it at least in March 2022, Bruce retired from acting after being diagnosed with aphasia, which had impaired his verbal communication skills. Just a little less than a year later, the Golden Globe winner's family shared that he had been diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia. Writing in a February 2023 statement, FTD is a cruel disease that many of us have never heard of and can strike anyone. Today, there are no treatments for the disease, a reality that we hope we can change in the years ahead. As Bruce's condition advances, we hope that any media attention can be focused on shining a light on this disease that needs far more awareness and research. Yeah, very, very sad situation with Bruce Willis, a beloved actor who did a lot of great movies. And of course, at his age, he still can be a full of life, uh, live full life and, you know, enjoy his life. But it's not happening, unfortunately, and wish him all the best. And who knows? Maybe we'll definitely uh, find some drug that can help him re recover. Who knows? Uh, let's let's see from optimistic view, right? A few years ago, we didn't never heard about AI, and now it's a part of our lives. Every day we see, you can go on a website and ask AI whatever you want, or you can see like almost every day these robots can do everything, like you know, run, uh, walk, do whatever, and like five, seven, ten years ago, it wasn't. It was not possible. It was. It, it wasn't like only in uh, futuristic movies. So you never know. So let's hope uh, everything uh, will go in a positive way for Bruce and his family. And so far, um, I just want to know what do you think. Let's discuss. Uh, I know a lot of people actually have negative views about Emma. Uh, I want to know what do you think and also if you have a little bit of your time please share this video with your friends like this video subscribe to this channel uh, turn the notification button because uh, it shows that some activity going on in this video it shows YouTube that it can promote it uh, it's important for this channel because I want us to grow as a family because we are see you next one